Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Imona Project. We here at the Imona Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, inspiration, guidance, advice to Noahides, uh, converts, and Balichuva, those Jews who are returning uh, to the Creator, returning to Judaism. And um, I was thinking of the, uh, uh, or the Tanakh, where the, the Jewish scriptures um, describe uh, the wisdom of Solomon, how he was the, uh, the wisest uh, of all men, and uh, wiser than other men. And some people have, have observed, and it's a very unusual statement, he was wiser than fools, and um, even wiser than fools. What does this mean? Um, the words appear meaningless. The, the words appear, no pun intended, foolish. It sounds narish, foolish. Um, I'm not the first one to ask these questions. The uh, people went to Rabbi Levi Yitzhak of Berdyshev and asked him to explain these, these seemingly odd words. He's the, King Solomon was the wisest of all men, wiser than fools. What's going on here? And it was the Rabbi Levi Yitzhak of Berdyshev who explained that um, one of the characteristics of a nar, of a fool, of his uh, narshkeit, his foolishness, is that he considers himself, the fool considers himself uh, wiser than anyone else. And that, uh, and his folly is, is not folly at all. It's, it all makes sense. The wisdom, the chokhmah of, of King Solomon was so great that it could assume different guises, including the guise of a fool. He can actually, he could actually converse with fools on a level where they understood him. And he could get his message across. He had true conversations uh, with, uh, with fools and impress their hearts. It wasn't just at an intellectual level. He got them right at the heart, until they recognized uh, their foolishness and professed who they really were. And that's, according to Rabbi Levi Yitzhak, a Berdachev, that's what that expression means. He was wiser than, than fools. Uh, he was so wise, he was able to communicate um, with, with people and cut through the narshkite, cut through the foolishness and get to the heart, get to their essence, so that even they could understand and he could impart their wisdom, his wisdom to them. Um, we're going to be doing uh, more videos along these lines. Please come back, please watch, please learn. I hope uh, you're finding these videos of some help. Uh, I hope you're finding them of some benefit. Um, please come back. And uh, until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.